can I ask you, do you trust the government? No. You don't? Do you trust your own senses? Um, no. You don't trust your own senses? No, I, I sometimes make mistakes, so... Right. But you, you depend on your senses for everyday life. Yeah, you know, pretty much, yeah. You couldn't yeah. get dressed or... No, you know. that's true, yeah. So, so it's safe so to say... Sometimes I look at myself and think I've made a mistake and that yeah. was damp to what I just had a sense about, do you know what I mean? But you do trust your senses, yeah, obviously. Yeah, most of, of course. Most of course. Yeah, yeah. Can I ask you, you, do you understand what natural science is? Yeah. So if I say to you, for me, natural science is observing, testing, repeating, to be able to scale it, all claims about reality should fit into that criteria? Um. yeah. Yeah, for it to be scientific, it has to. Yeah. Yeah, or we can make claims like, I have unicorns. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah no, right, okay. fair enough, yeah. So, yeah. can I ask you then, do you believe you live on a round planet, a ball-shaped planet? Um, I don't know, I don't know if it's exactly spherical, but I believe I live on a planet that's... It's yes. ball-shaped, this, oblate yeah. spheroid, yeah. you know, that's Neil deGrasse yeah, Tyson's I guess, I guess, Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> can, can, I ask, can I ask you why you believe that? Um... I suppose because I've seen evidence that it curves and you see images of it out of space and you see that it's a ball and so, it makes sense So when you look way. out into the horizon, can I ask you what shape the horizon is? Well, I think it depends on which angle you're looking at the horizon from. So if you're looking from really, really high up, there is evidence that it curves. Have you seen that? Um, no, but I've never been in a, a thing that high by trust scientists that tell I, me that. What, what if that I say to that. you that there's, there's amateur balloon footage from 121,000 feet that shows absolutely no curvature? I, I, well, I would be taking your view over science. Would you look into view. it? No. No? No. Can I ask you, you understand <laughs> water, how water behaves? Um, well, kind of. If I say to you... I'm an English teacher, you well, know, I you understand if, I drink it. <laughs> if, if I say to you, well, you drink you drink water, so yeah. you know you have to put it in a cup yeah. or a bowl, you yeah. have a bath, you go to a swimming pool, yeah. you go to a lake, you go to a dam. Yeah. Is the surface of the water ever curved? Um, well, but surely that's your perception, isn't it, from where you're standing on the earth? Well, if we go back to measurable, testable, repeatable claims about reality, <laughs> could could you show me one body of water conforming to the exterior of a shape? No, but I'm not a scientist. But, you, but do you think it's reality that you could show that? I don't know. I'm not a scientist. Okay. Um, do, you, do you think that, that space up there is an actual vacuum? Uh, I, I guess so. You well, can't, in space, no one can hear you So scream. again, going back to natural science... Uh, opposing pressure systems, like a vacuum and a positive pressure system, we know 100% of the time through testing, observing and repeating that they must have a solid separation between the two of them or we will have equilibrium. You've, you lost me about the, about two minutes into what you were talking about, <laughs> to be honest. <laughs> I, I believe in what in what scientists tell me. So you, you have faith then on the, in, the sir, in science. I have certainly more faith in science than I do in the government. Yes. Yeah. So, but you know, <laughs> if I say to you again, you know, natural science is observing, measuring, testing, repeating. Yeah, but I don't think it's just anyone can do that. I think you have to have a certain amount of knowledge, and you have to be able to repeat it under certain tests. And there's a lot of money and a lot of academics doing jobs that I haven't got the brain capacity to be able to either understand completely or completely question with any validity. Yeah. I am an expert in not that, so I trust right. the people who are experts. So in that. then, that's, that's There's a certain belief. amount of faith in there, but yeah. I, do, I don't think it's about. I don't think it's faith when it can be proven, and I believe that scientists, when they tell me it can be proven, I don't think that's faith. Well, I think that that's um, logic. Well, yes, is what we're into. We're into natural science and logic, and I'm going to give you a card. Now, the, right. the, the card that I'm going to give you for is for a channel of mine, and it's been open for nearly two years now. And we invite anybody who thinks that they have proof to prove that the Earth is a sphere. Right. And in that two okay. years, we've had absolutely nobody who can prove that the Earth is okay. a sphere. Does that concern you in any way? No. No? No. Uh, no, no. I wonder so, who you've given the card to. <laughs> well, we're, we're inviting, we're going to send letters to lecturers, yeah? to physicists, to scientists. To yeah. any, we've actually got a guy who's, you know, he's, he's an honours degree graduate from Glasgow University in Mass and Physics. He understands that what they told him is absolutely rubbish because there's no observable, measurable, repeatable okay. tests <laughs> to prove that the Earth is a sphere. So you know about the International Space Station? Yeah. You know that they say that it exists. Would it, would, it concern, <laughs> would it concern you? Do you think that that's a huge achievement of man to put a tin can up there that's flying at 17,500 miles per hour? Uh, yeah. Do, do, you think, do you think it's a concern then that there is absolutely no video or real photographs of them constructing that? No. 
you think that should be documented? No, why? Well, why on earth would I need to see that? You know, no, what, you, no, surely, what, but surely, you know, if you if you're putting millions and billions of pounds or dollars or whatever it was into something like that, you're not going to just put it out into the world so that other people can steal that idea. It's their it's their technology, and what on earth is a layperson like me going to gain from watching that? Yeah. Uh, yeah. No. Well, sorry. You know, so well, you know, it's, we document all sorts of things. If we construct anything like a bridge, you know, like the Erskine Bridge along the road, there's been documented. Yeah, but that's not. That's not. It. Yeah, but that's not a. Uh, that's not a multi-million, billion dollar space thing, is it? That's something that the public use. This is not something the public use. This is yeah. something that's done for, for something the public don't need to yeah. to use. I'm not going to go to the International Space Station yeah. anytime soon. So, so no. I mean, you might think I'm a bit close-minded but I'm not but I think oh, no, we, we have to we, we're going to go now no thank you very I'll much for your, your time thank you yes yeah. no problem thank you very much for <laughs> no. that